Starring Matthew Wonderland. Produced by Matthew Wonderland. Directed by Matthew Wonderland. Cinema. Hi, my name is Matthew Wonderland. A chemical reaction is a process in which a substance changes into a different substance. A chemical reaction is different from a physical reaction, such as ice melting, because in a chemical reaction, the molecules of the substance change. Some chemical reactions are not reversible. Others are. I'm going to show you an example of both. First, I'm going to show a chemical reaction that is not reversible, cooking an egg. In this bowl, I have an egg that I have cracked. I am cooking. Now I am pouring the egg into this pan and I am cooking the egg with heat. See the egg is starting to get solid. The egg is now cooked. If I try to reverse the cooked egg by cooling it down the opposite of what I did, the egg will not go back to becoming an electric egg. I shall put the egg back in the freezer. Time is passing by with the egg still in the freezer. 15 minutes has passed. The egg did not change back. The reaction is not reversible. May not be reversible, but the eggs are still pretty tasty. <laughs> now I am going to show you a reversible chemical reaction. I'm going to show you a reaction between an acid and a base. An acid is a chemical that gives up a hydrogen atom when it reacts. Acids taste sour. Citrus juices like orange juice or lemon juice are acids. A base is a chemical that takes a hydrogen atom in a reaction, such as baking soda. Base tastes bitter and feels slippery. First, I am going to make an indicator that will change colors as the reaction goes back and forth. This is red cabbage. I'm cutting up the red cabbage into small pieces. I, I, I have placed the, the water and the cabbage into this pot. And now I'm going to start to boil. The cabbage is now boiling. I'm going to turn off the heat. Now straining out the cabbage juice and leaving the whole pieces in the pot. Here is the cabbage juice. I have put the cabbage juice in the ice cubes trays and I am now going to freeze it. Notice the time on the clock. It's about 9.15. The cabbage juice is still in the freezer. About three hours later. Let's go check on the ice cubes. I am now ready for the experiment. I have placed one of the three spirits into the three glasses. I am now going to put an ice cube in a frozen cabbage into each glass. Notice how the color is purple. Now, 
I'm going to take the vinegar and an acid and add it to one glass. Notice how the color changes to a pink. That is a chemical reaction. Now, I'm adding baking soda to another glass. Notice how it's turning blue, another chemical reaction. Now I can turn it back and forth by adding a small amount of the vinegar to this. Now it is a neutral amount and almost back to being all vinegar. The bubbles you see are carbon dioxide. Now I could, this cup is now neutral. Now, I'm now going to add baking soda to this glass. The color is starting to change back to its neutral color, purple. By first adding the acid or a base to a glass of water with cabbage juice, a chemical reaction took place that you can see the color change. When, when I, I then added the base to the acid or acid to the base, the color changed back. The chemical reaction was reversed. This has been chemistry with Matthew.